Hey everybody, Mature Simmer here. So, last round for Season 10 in TGC Tours is upon us. I'm gonna see how we do. My goal is to try to really do, just try to fix the string of bogeys from 14 on. You know, I don't get it on every hole every time, but like the last four or five holes in round three is is how I got the plus nine. Again, I'm you know doing like plus four and then suddenly get five bogeys in a row or something. So just parring those holes consistently would be a victory. Let's see how we do. All right, black tees we finish on as well. I mean, we've been on them the whole time and the wind is up to high, so. Not surprising. I figured we'd they'd, they'd try to make it entertaining for the final round. Hello there, and uh, a big fat welcome for me, John McCarthy. All right. To PGA Tour it's not terrible, but man, is it going to be those in my face again? I think when I started third round, it was a headwind, and there's a lot of holes that then this turns into a headwind in the westerly direction here. And best of luck to but you as you endeavor. As good as I can do. Third round, I, I ended up in those bunkers. I just did not get a good shot off. Wasn't terrible, but it wasn't enough to carry anything. All right, so we're going to do that. We'll see how far how over we go. Hey, fast. Looks like this one's going left. It's not terrible honestly it that's a kept me out of the rough with the wind third all right let's get it close 79 percent i like that and you've got this much left to save par on this one all right just slight movement so let's see if we can pull it off Trying to get okay, good, off today at good paths. Um, a few birdies we can catch out there yet. I think it was just the default on the green speed. If I remember, I didn't see anything odd there, so that should be medium. Wow. 14. That's one way to make the wind not matter, I guess. Not what I wanted, though. Not what I wanted at all. All right, Here's we lose second shot on hole number 10 two. yards rolling back down the hill. Only difference is we get a shot here. Yeah, I think there's enough that I can carry this, so. All right, cool. Should stay on the fairway. Yeah, you'll take that. And this is a hard one to get on, on into two. anyway. Um, no, no. want to be normal. So, I'm going to go back one. We're going to go over here. A little bit more. We should be all right there. Beautiful, beautiful. A little harder than I would like, but it's going to work out in... Whoa! That was an odd bounce. Well, we missed the green, but that's all right. Life does go on. Here's your fourth shot. Hmm. That was an odd bounce. Too far. Far, far too far. Good luck on this one. This, save, possibly. This is going to make this tough. Downhill the whole way. Like, this goes by... This goes by, it's never stopping. Ah, no good. <sighs> wow. I really thought that was going in. All right. Nothing to worry about, just a bogey putt, that's all. I mean, I was definitely worried about the distance, but obviously I was also trying to get it in. Four ahead of us. So disappointed that one didn't didn't fall for me. Okay, good to have a nice solid tee shot back. With oh, this is gonna really roll. We'll get it back. And second shot here on the third. All right, let's see. 
I can't do a flop out of there is the problem. Eek. Oh boy. Well, luckily it kept rolling up the hill. Now there we can do a flop. Being up as we are, I'm gonna let that go that way. Here we go, twenty nine feet. Not the result I was expecting, to be frank and honest. I was really thinking I'd be a lot closer than that. Decent swing path, I would say. Well, it's mm -hmm. going right by the hole. It is it's going right by feet. that hole. This putt's good so far. Oh well, that's uh, uh, two bogeys. So it's just getting. So I've talked about the last second, third round. Kind of my next mountain to climb is absolutely. Uh, shot placement, especially obviously as I'm getting to the green. Oh boy. Hmm. I took my eye off my normal spot when I swing. I don't know if that was enough to be my problem, but clearly the result was poor. Well, I didn't do that that time, and still got the same poor result. Okay, here's our third shot. So. No more excuses, it's just bad play. All right, way too many shots to get to this point, so this is going to be likely a really yeah, bad hole again. All right, wind blowing in my face. I'm going to go up one more. Just the lie on this is so extreme. Well, yeah, this is a tough call. the very sure slow so definitely go. takes well, missed the green on that one, takes but, uh, crazy uh, into account. Setting up for your fifth stroke here. All right, 101. Very fast. It's going to roll off, isn't it? Yep. And lining up your sixth shot here. Well, I kind of called it nice that it was just going to be an ugly okay, hole. That putt's done. Haven't had a lot of multiple bogeys. Um, Let's see how we do here you know, double, fifth. triple bogeys is what I mean when I'm saying that in this event. So I've, I've at least had that grace that I haven't had that situation. All right, wind is definitely doing its thing. A little f more than I was hoping, but not actually as bad as it yeah, started to look like early on. on that definitely not a chip. You know what? It's. I think it's still going to go a little bit that way, so I'm going to go the... Wait. I don't know why it changed. Uh, not uh -oh. enough. Not enough. No. All right, this next putt for the par. Got a headwind to deal with on this hole. All right. Well, we're not going to have any danger now. I'm always like overdriving it. I'm not even going to make it. So the question is, let's take a good look here. Yeah, I probably really want to be here. I, I don't want to be, like, on the hill or something. So I'm going to shoot over here. We'll see what that turns like into. There we go. Yeah, okay. that's... Because the nice thing is it's, it's a much more flat lie than I'd have otherwise. In theory, a full swing shouldn't go too far. Well, the very fast isn't going to help, but sometimes with the chips it works out, chip. and it did, I would say. This one's just a four foot putt. All right. so, so good. Swing path oh, was good. That's the key for for that. I'm still struggling with, with maintaining a good a process for, for my putt path. 
That there is a slice. End up in the fairway. Thank you. All right. Because at least it gives me a shot for something here. I got to go that way. I can see the lie already. Okay. Not terrible. Not great. But should work. Should stay. Oh, nope. Decided to dump it off. Hmm. I really thought it was kind of funneled up, but it like cleared the hill just enough and then ran down. Alright, I think I gotta go the whole way because this is gonna be, yeah, 160 plus a little more. So, yeah, we've gotta. I think it's laying flattish. So, I'm gonna go over here and then count on the wind. Well, I read it wrong, obviously. There was some lie there. Should be on unless it dumps me off. Yeah. All right. All right. Back in the fairway now. 25 Agreed. yards, I'll go ahead and we'll chip it. Normally I'd putt it, but 75 feet, that's a long way. All right. This one's tracking. Swing path was good. In the hole for the bogey. But once again, a bogey right after a birdie. I think gameplay that a lot of people have, Swing sadly, in real right. golf or whatever, too. But, oh man, this is a. T wow, this is a hard pin placement. It's kind of. I mean, because even the slope here, everything slopes away. Everything slopes away. I'm gonna try over here. Oh, wonderfully struck. A little too hard, but it, I mean, it'll work. It'll at least get me on the green. Man, this is just gonna fall right off. Oh no, it's gonna slow down. That's a safe shot. Wow. 13 feet left All right. to the hole. Let's take advantage. Not a great swing path, a good line. but the ball fell. That was a nice little birdie. It's kind of a dia more diagonal than I would have. Well, I don't want any diagonal. I was gonna say more diagonal than I'd like, but there's all no right, diagonal that I'd like. Fairway. You know what I mean? It's all that rhetorical speaking. Okay, counting on the wind to carry the bunker. Cross me over. All right. Because, yeah, that was a Getting little a more to the right than, than I was targeting, for sure. Hmm. So if I go there, with the wind, I'm going to try it, though. Seems like it'd be too much. But a lot of times when they're short like this, they don't carry as much. With the wind, nice, nice dump back. Way to go out there, looking good. And here's what you're dealing with for a birdie. Wow, downhill a long way. It's gonna go more than that. And I was wrong. I mean, some of it was my swing for sure, my putt, my path, but. Um, Oh, that'll work for your but par. Nicely got the done. par. And at this point, sometimes that's the victories. <laughs> Just not not getting a bogey. Because um, I think I bogeyed Spending the ninth on to a, a lot. Hole on this one. I think two of the three times I bogeyed it. All right, that is not going to carry. Waited a little longer than I would have liked. Didn't get a great swing path. But all in all, the result's going to... Uh, it's going to save me from myself, for Here's sure. Second shot on the tenth. All right, I'm going to hit it up one. Because it is just a pitch. But I want to make this sure I'm up there. Good. It could Here's be. What you're looking at for birdie. And those are kind of the results that I'm talking about. Like, that's the type of landing that if I could somehow, you know, again, I mean, I'm sure every golfer in the world, 
be like, yeah, if I could land within five feet of the hole. I mean, even the pros say that too, I'm sure, but. All that for nothing. I really was having some exciting expectations there. We've got about 235 from here. I might still be able to make it. Wow. This is going to be a tough one. This is a risk shot for sure. Okay, well, I addressed it well. Bounce right. Come on. All right, we are on. So and good roll. Oh, really good roll. That went really on far. The green with that, one. Well done. that was like the most morose, about somber feet. walk for something that didn't turn out to be so bad. That was crazy. Oh my gosh, terrible. Terrible oh path. Again, part part of what I'm feeling I have to do is I'm like artificially going to the right, but it, sometimes I really go to the right, and that's obviously didn't didn't result Good. in what I wanted. And same thing; nice it was time. a diagonal. So it's hard to it, there's like this fine line. So I'm just trying to figure out how to make it work because otherwise I'm always shifted a little to the right of the line and I have this where basically, you know, the, the feedback was, hey, you're starting and you've got like 2% in the white. Like, that's part of what's making it challenging for you. So that's what I've been working on for a few events. A little further than I thought. A little wayward on that approach. Okay, well, okay, clearly so it's doing a lot there. Can't get rid of the flag. Might not be a bad thing. Although I usually don't go flying by where having the flag in the hole would help that much. A little better, but at least we kind of had the bottom half in the path. But Just, uh, yeah, a little too much on there. All right, drop this on in and save your park. Man, pin placement again. Oh, oh, man. That's way too I hard. To go from here. I, th that, I, I didn't look at my downhill, if I'm being honest, and I bet that was way downhill. Yikes, that went right by. All right. This is hurting. And this one for double bogey. Yep, it is way downhill, so. Oh, it's getting that there. worked out, even though I yanked okay, it entirely. On. But a double bogey. Mm. All right, let's see what we can do here on the 13th. All right, wind to my back. Oh, you hit that one well. So that is the kind of shot you want when you have a big tailwind like that. Because you get that kind of Setting result. About 220 yards away. So I should have no problem getting on, on here. Alright, it's not a wood, so I'm going to leave it. I think that will be okay. So it shouldn't roll too far. Oh... Another opportunity squandered. Setting up for our third Just shot. squandered. There's nothing I need to do with that other than hit it. I can't shorten it much, up so. Here for your fourth shot. Go in. And Thank you. A fancy little chip shot, nicely done in there for the bird. Okay. Every once in a while I get one of those, so that's all right. There's the little tunnel I finally saw last time. I hadn't so seen that the first two four. rounds. All right, so this and toward the end, these are the ones that anyone I can avoid bogeys on, it's a victory. I've never, oh God, knock on wood, I've never bogeyed all of them from this point on. It's been close sometimes, but I've usually parred at least one, but it'd be great to par all of them. Okay, 
decent start. Cross that, cross that. All right, that works out. Quite a bit above this green. We might need a little less club. All right, the wind's in my face, but um, we're back 10. We're basically gaining 13, and then we're going to have a little bit of extra power. So I'm just going to leave it with what I've got. Didn't like the feeling of that, but it worked out. I was really worried we were going to get a bad result. God, oh, uh, hmm. missed the green on that rejected one. with the berm. Your third shot. All right, I almost need a partial again, which sucks. I couldn't get a partial as much as I tried. Potentially to save par. I swear I was getting shooting like 75%, but clearly that's not what the result was. Okay, downhill again. Go Very in. Good one. Oh, you... Oh, that was almost... You stinker. Here's an 11-footer. You are kidding me. That did not look like it was going to have any shot of going right. Because initially I'm like, well, I'll just leave it. I'm like, no, it's going to pull left. And then it didn't. Alright, well, that one I didn't not bogey. Alright, again, two out of the three before this I had terrible tee shots on this hole. So I'm glad I could yeah, at least clean that up. Out. Um, all right, I'm going to go there, and then around for the the wind. Good shot, good shot, good shot. All right, I guess I needed one club up on that. Oh, well, if not all more. Right, this one in, this one for birdie. Man, this is a long way. All right, decent swing path. Close, right but no cigar. Four feet to go. All right, now at least at least not a bogey there. So that's a bit of a victory. Although I, with the double bogey on the first one before, does is it? I don't know. <laughs> does it negate it? With the ball. Okay. Wow. Huh. That's unfortunate. Alrighty. Second shot on the 16th. I'm hoping that'll be pretty decent. Not bad. Not bad. And you've got this left to save your par. But the part of the problem with the bogeys is these the greens are just challenging. They're not flat. And just trying to get anything, Here's even the close ones, to fall five. sometimes has been hard. Oh, I Solid thought that was going to lip out. I was worried, but again, still got a bogey. Now it's just right. seeing That's if I can stay on. below 17. 30. That would be nice. Nice swing on that. All right. I've mainly had good shots on this one, I think. Sometimes they roll off, but this one did not. I might have a shot at making it. Hmm. That might work out, though. Eh, it rolled right off. Setting up here now for our third shot. It's way downhill. So I need to shoot really short. And even then, wow. So you can see the problem. For the birdie. You can see the problem. What a break. Come 
Come on. Come on. Wow. I don't know that I've bur I may have birdied it on my um I may have had a birdie in these back holes in my practice round. I don't think I birdied it on any of the the actual rounds. So, wow. That's great. Oh, it's like do I overthink it? Do I do Second shot on I, was, the 18th. I, I didn't think I was, but clearly the result was horrendous. Because this, again, creates almost a guaranteed bogey with a tee shot like that. Again, you go 80 yards. This one's your third. I mean, I can't, I can't even get there if I wanted to. You know, I had a decent out, and again, good solid shot, but... I'm so far away it doesn't matter I like that so now I'd have to hole out to not get a bogey to get to that pin from here. is it possible of course it's possible is it likely no maybe this one I'll kick to the left and for a 78 on your round hmm. downhill and then I think flat maybe a little bit uphill but probably a little bit harder than I would have liked yeah it's rolling wow a lot harder oh man let's get back on the green and this is your sixth shot close nice well done and with that, Triple bogey. That is a bad ending. And that was a bit of fun. Thanks so much for the round. I'm glad All that right. you brought me along for So the ride. where did we we'll end up? Time. Not great, that's for sure, but... Yeah, the back six are just... So I ended up plus 30. All right. Well, that ends Season 10, folks. No tour card. Um, I'm not going to even pretend that I think that there's a possibility. Um, I mean, again, the the good things, I guess. I've, I've, I'm at least at the point, even with what happened. Um, I've got single digit over rounds, which was a target for two thirds of the season. Sometimes just to even get one of those. So I can't say I haven't progressed and improved over the course of the season, but uh, we're not anywhere near. And realistically, I, I've said it earlier, but you know, in case you're just tuning in right at the end, see what there is to say at the end of the season. Um, you know what I've seen, monitoring some other folks that had been viewers of the channel and had commented and have since gotten their tour card and have been. Uh, competitive and and staying in their flights at least I have to be at the point where I'm playing even or better golf for the event or even if I get a tour card I'm just going to lose it um, it's it, you know and usually you've got to be under to not get demerits or demotion points on even the lowest level tours so you know, even for the event is probably still not enough. So I, I'm i not at the level I need to be to really be competitive here. Um, I don't know how long the off season will be. Uh, I, I, they usually, I think, don't post anything. I did start looking and uh, monitoring TGC tours back in season nine. It's kind of when I started getting into PGA Tour 2K23 came across it so I did see the off season last time I want to say it was four to six weeks um, the challenge I've said this probably in the middle of the season or two-thirds of the season and unless some mega donor comes in at the end I think they're gonna be far far short of their goal um, and they need like 12,000 a season to pay for the servers and all of that kind of stuff so there is a bit of concern because I, I think we're only at like 60 percent funding um, I've done my part, I will say that. So um, I'm not going to be doing anything else to try to get us there. 
but I'm hoping it doesn't mean like if there's that big of a shortfall that what we start hearing is well we can't do it or I mean I'm hoping worst case they're just like well we can't run as many flights so we've got to you know cut our servers in half or something because clearly people aren't willing to donate enough to keep going and to me that's completely fair like if people are just playing but they're refusing to contribute enough to keep things going I mean with the amount of players we've got um, you know again I'm, I'm happening to look at uh, a flight that I have up there uh, and I don't know if these are the people just in that flight or in in total but even so you know I'm looking at people that are ranked 1700s or something so in theory there's well over a thousand approaching 2,000 players here so if everybody gave six bucks um, one point in the season they'd be funded so that it, it certainly isn't a big ask for people so it, it's disappointing that as with most things in life you get some handful of people that, that keep it going and fund it and everybody else freeloads off it and doesn't do anything to help support something so um, hopefully that'll change I don't know the one or two people that might watch it that are on TGC tours and maybe aren't donating that it shames into donating probably aren't going to be enough to make up uh, you know four grand or whatever we're, we're short five grand but um, we'll see what happens but I'm hoping TGC tours doesn't just suddenly vanish but either way I mean I've enjoyed the journey uh, I hope you've enjoyed the journey uh, if you've enjoyed this episode and haven't dropped a like uh, please consider that it helps with the spread of the channel and get folks involved and aware if you're not a subscriber please consider that it just makes things easier for you to find and I will see you next time